right, this is question number three. Form code, test form code A, part two, the tear off section. All right. The question reads, evaluate the following. The cotangent arc sine of two thirds, that's part A. Now for this arc sine, we're going to look at that by itself. So arc sine of two thirds equals theta. That means that the sine of theta equals two thirds. Now we can draw a triangle of this. This is theta. Now sine is opposite over hypotenuse, so the opposite is 2 and the hypotenuse is 3. Using the Pythagorean theorem, we can find out this side, which is going to be 3 squared, minus 2 squared, square root of that, and that's going to be 9 minus 4, square root of that, and that's just the square root of 5. So this side here is the square root of 5. Now we know that the arc sine of two thirds is theta, so that means we can replace this arc sine of two thirds with theta, and we're left with the cotangent of theta. We've got a triangle built here with theta here. The cotangent is the adjacent over the uh, the opposite. So the adjacent in this case is square root of five. And that's over 2. So the answer for part A is the square root of 5 over 2. Now part B reads the inverse cosine of the cosine of 5 pi over 4. Now for this one, if it was just co if it was cosine out here and the inverse cosine inside, you would just be able to do a simple cancellation. But because the inverse is on the outside, we need to bring this angle from this quadrant up into this quadrant. Now to do that, we're going to subtract this angle by pi over 2 and that's going to leave us with, well first of all we have to find the common denominator here so that's going to give us 5 pi over 4 minus 2 pi over 4 which gives us 3 pi over 4 so the cosine of 3 pi over 4 inversed and now from here we can cancel out the cosines and you're just left with 3 pi over 4. And so that's our answer for part B.